Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever it comes up. Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords. Well, we had this one yesterday too. Different deck, right? This is somebody who is stuck, trapped, all tied up, feeling like there's no place to go, feeling like they need to stay where they're at, but they don't have to. So this is kind of interesting. Somebody is stuck it's in their thoughts. They're stuck in their head. They're not making any moves. <laughs> Fear. This person is fearful for some reason. Ooh, King of Swords reversed. Now this is somebody who's cold. Very cold uncaring somebody that just doesn't care right here I don't care I don't care if you're stuck I don't care if you're in prison I don't care if you need my help I don't care I don't care we have an uncaring individual here it's almost like this person doesn't care that they're making another person suffer but then again they aren't because this person can escape. <laughs> Ooh, Seven of Swords. Be careful. When you see Seven of Swords, there's something up. This is a very sneaky individual. Take a look at his face. All right, he's sneaky, he's sly. Look at him. Smug. He's getting away with it all. He is. He's just getting away with it. Yes, he is. Ooh, yes. He, getting away with it all. Absolutely. Right in his glory. We have somebody here that is right in their glory. And they're just like, I can do whatever I want. I can have whatever I want. I don't care what anybody thinks. Meanwhile, there's somebody else here that is in this scenario that is trapped. Somebody is trapped with another person who is... Uh, who, who, who the hell is... This person is... A snake of some sort. This person is a piece of shit. Sorry what happens when I can't think of what I'm trying to say. Anyhow, um, two of pentacles reversed. This person, this person right here makes uh, poor decisions one right after another. It's just like a constant freaking stupidity. You can see what kind of mood I'm in. Anyhow, yeah, so we have somebody here that is, uh, overwhelmed this person overextends themselves they bite off more than they can chew they're 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 it's like they're fighting constantly to prove themselves in some way this person has a lot of chaos in their life just saying very unbalanced this person goes to extremes okay <coughs> overboard really goes overboard. We have a very uh, well this isn't a good person anyway. This person is not a good person. They don't care who they hurt. They don't care who is suffering. They don't care. They don't care who is suffering. It's all about themselves. I keep on to see how this person is like a, a glutton. 
they overindulge, they're unwilling to compromise, this guy is smug, this person is a financial mess, this person is unbalanced, they're not evolved, they're not very spiritual, they're not awake, this person is uh, angry with the world, this person has hard feelings which has caused them to be cold. So the best thing to do is to overindulge and to medicate, self-medicate, right? This person it does. This person overindulges in everything. They don't save any money. They can't. They can't because they, they probably they could buy drugs or they drink a lot or whatever. This person is totally making poor decisions, poor choices. This person probably doesn't have very much money because they want to live the high life that they really can't afford to live. We do have somebody here that has addictions that is is really dwindling their bank account in a bad, bad way. This person is trying to uh, uh, bury life's challenges instead of deal deal with them. Right? I'm gonna I'm gonna what's that called? It's like block them, block the feelings, block it out. Let's block out those past pains. Let's block out all those challenges. Let's not even deal with them. We'll 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 medicate. We'll do drugs and we'll drink and we'll go overboard. So that's what's happening here. So somebody is really really going overboard. This right there's gonna somebody could lose their balance. Just because, just saying, this is somebody that could be losing their balance. This guy's really smug. He's really smug. He could, let's see what's going to happen. Oh, he could fall down. I, that's what I was going to say. He could fall down. Somebody could fall down. They could fall down. Interesting. Interesting. So we got the tower reversed. So somebody, um, you know, they may have been able to avoid some sort of shake up for quite some time but I don't think they're going to be able to avoid it anymore because something is about to be turned upside down maybe their life is about to be turned upside down or it already has happened it already has happened and that's why this person is overindulging you know um, hmm. Now the star card is a card of hope. It's a card of wish fulfillment. It's a card of dreams. It's also a card of protection. But this is a blockage. Remember we talked about that a minute ago. So it's like there's no forward movement. Something didn't come together. Something didn't come together like it was supposed to. Now, this is a card of wish fulfillment as well, and this one is too, but this is, it's not time. Something has been turned upside down. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, trying to delay. Somebody is, just something is delayed. Happiness is delayed. Because this is wish fulfillment, this is wish fulfillment, this is a delay, this is a delay, and this is a delay. So we got delay. Somebody's wish, or, you know, prayer that they asked is being delayed. I know that's a different message, but just one whoever that part is for, we have a delay. We have a delay in coming together. We have a delayed reunion of some sort. Or a delayed exchange. Hmm. This is definitely a delay, but this is a wish. A wish coming true. Oh, well, I hope so. So that is love. That's a new opportunity for love right there. So we do have love. We have love, but there is a delay of some sort. There is a delay. And what is this delay? Oh, we got we got somebody here that doesn't have good intentions. Somebody that can't open their heart. Somebody that can't follow their heart. Somebody that can't communicate. Somebody that can't master their emotions. I asked what the delay is. We have somebody here, and this is a person that is... Well, definitely very cold. 
a very cold-hearted individual here. Somebody may be using emotional blackmail to stop. This is emotional blackmail right here. And this is stop. And this is delay. See, somebody is uh, using emotional blackmail to delay somebody from getting what they want. Interesting. Interesting. So this is emotional blackmail. <laughs> Trying to keep somebody stuck. Aha, uh -huh. somebody is stuck in a state of suspension, in a, trying to prove something, maybe to society. Needing to see things from a new perspective, but refusing to do so. We have somebody here that is very stubborn. And it's like the, instead of dealing with challenges, instead of dealing with things, they're just really over-medicating, just so you know. We, somebody, we have somebody here that is really, really over-medicating on drugs and alcohol, one or other, or both. It could be even food. It's, there's like an addiction here. And, it's, and, and, there's, and there's extremes. Extremes, okay? So this could be an extreme addiction of some sort. <coughs> Could be dealing with Pisces, could be dealing with Cancer, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay, what do we have here? We have somebody here that is drinking to cover up their pain. That way they don't have to talk about it, they just bury it. They just bury their feelings, they don't have to talk about it. What is this sly son of a bitch doing up here? What's he doing? What's his plan? Woo! Oh, he's he's planning on taking down the Empress? Good luck. Is that what he was planning on doing? He, hmm, what is his plan? We got a partnership here. Thinking about, thinking about investing in something. Thinking about giving up. Thinking about relocating. Thinking about what he should do next. What should I do? Thinking about a partnership might have something to do with a mother. So we got this person right here, but he's very sneaky. Right now, he, he's got the power in his hands and he knows it. He's like, ha, I have all the power in my hands. And he loves it. This person loves it. But he's about to lose some, some, his balance for sure. With the tower reversed and the two of pentacles reversed and the temperance reversed. Somebody's about, it's like they're about to lose it. There could be some upcoming frustrations, or they've been frustrated, and that's why they're medicating, you know, self-medicating to the extreme. Anyway, so we were clarifying this card, the Seven of Swords. This guy is very, I don't like the look on his face. He is so cunning. He is so smug. It's the kind of person you'd like to punch right in the face. That's what I got there. Anyway, um... Empress reversed. Now the Empress reversed. She is a bitch. She's queen bitch. All right, and reversed. She's not. She's she's got to do whatever she's got to do. Um. She's not in a good place. Okay, she's not in a good place with the Empress reversed. She's not. She's smothering. She could be selfish. Um. She may have neglected a child. This guy is thinking about a partnership. Maybe it's he's thinking about wh what he's going to do. What is he going to do? Does he... Maybe he's got a mother. You know. That is influencing his decision. I don't know. This guy is thinking about his next move. He is. He's very stubborn. He's selfish. He is selfish. He's cold hearted. He doesn't communicate well. He can't master his emotions. He buries his pain and his anger in uh, 
alcohol, drugs, whatever. And it's been there's it's caused a delay. It's caused the delay of wish fulfillment. But there is an opportunity for love right here. There is is. This is an opportunity for love. Ooh, the Knight of Wands. Now this is act now. Think later. So this is somebody's gonna take action very soon. Suddenly take action. Somebody's going to suddenly follow their heart or open their heart after not opening their heart. This is somebody coming in quick. Now this could be a new love. There's been a time of delay. There's been a time of suspension where somebody's just been in waiting. Somebody's been waiting for something. There's no doubt. There's been some waiting here. But this is movement. So something is about to like just, just come right in. Some, there's going to be some sort of movement. Ooh, Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. She's got a golden opportunity in her hand, don't she? Big one. Big one. She's got money. She's got money. She's grounded. She's down to earth. She's motherly. She's loyal. She's just waiting. She's just waiting for this arrival. She's waiting. She's like, just waiting. Waiting for love. Waiting for this person to come in. She's just going to sit there and wait. Because she knows her value. She is the queen of value. She's holding on to her value. It looks like this person is going to come in. This person is headed towards love and somebody that will value them. This person has a lot to offer and this person knows it. Hmm. Ooh. This is your hero. This is your hero. This is uh this is somebody that is noble, respectable. A leader, a warrior. This person has a lot of confidence. Somebody is coming in with a big old cup of love, right? A big old opportunity. It's like they're they are looking for love. And they have a and it's like they're passionate about it, very passionate about it. Looks like they're headed right towards this this queen of value here. This person who has been waiting. This person that knows their value and has just been sitting there waiting. Here it comes. This is victory. This is like the victory march. This is like, I just saw the sunset. This is like your Prince Charming riding out of the sunset, coming to the rescue. Did I start that out with any kind of rescue up here? If I didn't, I was thinking that. It might have been yesterday's reading. But this is like coming right out of the sunset, right? Very quickly. This is like your knight in shining armor. <laughs> That's what it is. Here I come to save the day. Hoo, 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 hoo. Sounds like a fairy tale to me, but anyhow, that's what it sounds like. Um, but this is, this leads to victory. It leads to success. There, there's, there's, uh, somebody headed towards a very valuable person. And it's like they've, they've come to to, uh, to rescue them. They've come to rescue them. Or they've come to give them something. There's been a delay, but I think that delay is over. Somebody is about to take action and they're going to they're gonna kick it into high gear. 
I think that, that they have a lot of support. I think that they have been told that, yes, you should do this. Go, go. Just go. Go get that opportunity. This person has his eye right on the opportunity. So I feel like there's definitely going to be a move. There's going to be some movement up here. This guy's been thinking about it. He has. He's been thinking about his next step. And he maybe this 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 guy right here has been been hiding. He hasn't. You know. He, that's why he's got that look on his face. He's been coming scheming up what he was going to do. But then again, the King of Swords in reverse is somebody that is cold and uncaring. Maybe they've had some financial losses or they've had a rude awakening. Maybe life has thrown them some challenges because of their selfishness. Maybe now they've been enlightened and they're gonna, all they want is love. I just want love and I'm going to get love. Somebody is headed towards a new love partner. And they, it's like, that's what the one I want, and I'm going to get it. Let me be your hero. So, oh boy. I am definitely going to get it. The lover's card. So yeah, this is an unexpected choice in love. An unexpected lover comes flying into your life. Pew! Here I am. I come to save the day. Don't you know? We're meant to be. I know we are. Don't you feel it? I knew it the minute I touched your hand. That was a little dramatic. Sorry. Unexpected choice in love. That is what we have. Somebody is making a decision. They've been thinking about it. They've been thinking about it. There may have been a mother or their child's mother or their mother or something that was in the way. And it's like, I think that that may have been the obstacle. That may have been why they were trapped and they weren't moving forward. Maybe it was even a father. It could have been a mother or a father that was uh, in the way of two people coming together. Could be anybody. Anyway, somebody is about to take action and they're about to kick it into high gear and go after a love connection that they feel very deeply is the one. I feel ya. I think it's you. You're the one. You're the one that I want. That's what I got. Good luck.